we had a very fun but very busy weekend and i am resetting our home from this weekend fun <laughs> cleaning tidy up organizing making some food for the rest of the week and then i'm gonna do some art and packaging so there's many many topics in this video stay until the end to see them all maybe it's harder 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 for me oh harder for me We are definitely out of the cooked food. <laughs> so today I am going to prepare some delicious home cooked meal. But until then, the breakfast and the lunch that Jord and the boys will take will be some sandwiches. After all the fun, I kind of like the mundane tasks on Monday morning because it's very quiet. I feel like I'm getting back everything to its place. And while I do all these routine tasks, my brain kind of digests <laughs> whatever I have seen, heard uh, over the weekend. It's really helping my brain to recover from all the noisiness, which is fun. But getting these tasks done helps my brain to rest vacuuming this seemingly clean mattress cover actually has lots of lint on it Now that the cold nights are here, I always like to keep a very cozy and fuzzy shirt next to my bed and I always had to throw it on the floor. So I wanted to fix that with some hooks. I'm just going to clean the window inside outside it's not worth that guys <laughs> as the neighbors are building their house and we are building the studio there's just constant dust and dirt coming onto the window so once it's all this building will be done that's when I'm going to clean it outside as well tasks that I have to remember by weekly I like to tie them together so when I change my sheet that's when I like to water my plants so that way I'm not going to forget to water them the entrance needs to be cleaned as well especially the floor
a few drops of my favorite essential oil on the floor will make the whole house smell amazing. For next, I'm going to working on folding some boxes for my products, which is not the most fascinating part, <laughs> but it's definitely necessary and kind of therapeutic. The dryer is run or whatever is that. Now that the sheet is clean, I'm going to put it back. I also spotted some <laughs> dirt on these shelves. So we got some organic apples that has some worms in there and they made their way through from one apple to the other and they left some track behind. <laughs> so I'm just cleaning up that. And I have some flooding that I have to finish up. The house chores that were on my list are done. So now I'm going to work on my art corner <laughs> well as much as i can i'm going to tidy up a little but i'm not gonna go into a uh, deep organizing because this is not a permanent place so it's just only for the next couple of weeks until my studio is done but i definitely want to organize my markers and i love these drawers so i started to organize my stickers in there and all those dried flowers but i find actually that it's even more useful for my markers because i can just pull it out and i get to see all the colors so i ordered more of these drawers and i cannot wait to organize everything with that guys i have so many new prints that are coming and i'm trying to make some pictures of them <laughs> for the website A 
another thing that I wanted to get done. I have a new teapot and a new mixer by Zwilling and I'm going to swap those out and the old ones I'm gonna give it to my friend and I added this silicone wire organizer that has a sticker on it so I can just stick to the side and that will hold the cord together so it's gonna be easier to get it out and put it back. It's starting to becoming a pattern. <laughs> I need 24 hours to get around to put away the items from my garden. I still have some green tomatoes, so I'm going to put them on the windowsill. I have successfully turned them into red ones just to leave them there. guacamole and smoked peppers are so good together if i would have some hard boiled eggs i would add them on the top it's even better with that Today the boys are gonna leave to the school a little bit later so I don't wanna make a lot of noise and I have a bunch of computer work so I'm going to work on that a little bit in the early hours. I wanna cook so we're going to have plenty of food for the next couple of days and I'm going to make some Hungarian goulash and then some other soup as well and then the goulash I wanna make that because we're going to have some paprikash that we're gonna eat but also I'm going to make a soup out of it so well originally I thought I'm going to make three different kinds of food with that but we ate a little bit more than I was expecting <laughs> so two different kinds of food that I'm going to make out of this dish. A very effective way to clean out a greasy plastic. I added a paper towel and a little bit of a baking soda and dish soap. I'm going to shake it and rinse it out. trying to bring out the best out of this laundry room situation and I want to separate the packaging items.
this snack offers everything that I like in a snack. It has the crunchy part, the smooshy part, <laughs> and it's very tasty. And since I added some hummus, it will fill me up. Closing up in my corners, I am going to just light up those cute little houses and I'm going to take care of the orders and I'm going to start to work on more prints. The paprika is on track, it's cooking very nicely, but I'm getting hungry because lunchtime is approaching. So I'm going to make something that I'm really craving and that is one of my favorite. Even as a child I loved this food so much. I have some zucchinis and I'm going to just fry them and coat them with some eggs and gluten-free flour. And I'm going to use some flour first so it can stick a little bit better to the zucchini. And I'm just going to deep fry them and I'm going to make a nice dip with that. <laughs> this room is definitely has the highest traffic and it makes me jumpy a little bit. <laughs> I don't have a lot of decor in my home but this is one of them and I treasure that so much I just added some extra string light to make it more festive Mount Laurel high fives for miles in spring Rainbow trout and hummingbird wing Golden I'll follow the golden Golden The dinner is ready. I cooked some gluten-free pasta and I'm going to add the paprika to it. And tomorrow I'm going to make a soup out of the leftover. Where I came from, it's very traditional to add some sour cream to it. I had some sour cream that was made from cashew and I put that one on the top. <laughs> After 
after dinner I got back to the painting it's very relaxing it takes away my mind to a place when it's very relaxed and I just really enjoy doing that and when I'm out I'm looking for that vintage flame but all complexions that I adore so hard to find they seem impossible to score so I Today I'm going to make two different kinds of soup. It's going to warm up our soul <laughs> and our body as the nights are getting more cold. I frequently like to use cabbage in my soups because it's very easy to store. It stays fresh longer than any other vegetables. Well, besides the carrots. Carrots are good too, but I love them as a filler in a soup and it's inexpensive. One of the soup is gonna be the Hungarian goulash and I'm going to make it in a way where I grew up so it depends on which area you are in Hungary and the area I came from we use a lot of caraway seed and I'm going to use some organic hot dogs in my cabbage soup <laughs> so don't get mixed <laughs> as I'm doing the two soups at the same time but the goulash i'm going to add some carrots and some turnip and parsley is crucial i didn't have any fresh so i'm going to add the dried version of that mixing two eggs and a little bit of a salt and some gluten-free flour and I'm going to mix it until I get the dough texture and I'm just going to pinch out little pieces and that's gonna be the noodle in the guia soup.
hope you enjoyed this time to spend with me to reset my home after a weekend and i wish you an amazing relaxing weekend thank you so much for watching until the end if you enjoy this content don't forget to like share and subscribe that helps my channel thank you so much again and i will see you guys soon bye